Hi, I'm Allison and this is my studio. Have you ever glued something onto a piece of paper in order to make an artwork? Do you know what that's called? It's called a collage. Today I thought we would make a nature collage. We're going to collect some nature, glue it onto a piece of paper, and then draw on it. Are you ready? Ask an adult to help you find some leaves or flowers that are a little bit hardy so that they won't rip when you glue them down on your paper. You'll need a Sharpie and a glue stick. I've tried regular glue, but the glue sticks work much better. Stems don't glue very easily to paper, so if you have a lot of little leaves, it might be nice to pull them off of the stem so they glue down. Here I have a vanilla leaf and a few bamboo leaves that I'm going to glue down and I think I'll make a dragon here. So I'm just planning it out a little bit and deciding and then I'll flip my leaf over and get a scrap piece of paper and glue and just carefully go from the stem side outward. This will help the leaf to stay together so it doesn't break and get your edges really well. And then you'll just glue the leaf down onto your paper and you can start drawing right away like me or if you want to plan it out a little more you can continue to do that. I'm drawing the dragon head here. There's the mouth and the body is going to stretch all the way around the page and this is the tail. Just some triangles for teeth. Uh, I'm giving it a second eye. And some legs. Next I'm going to glue some spikes on the back. These are bamboo leaves that I'm gluing on. I think it needs some horns and some ears and then maybe a few friends. I'm going to glue this little flower down. I separated the petals and they're going to turn into wings. I love that wood sorrel is the shape of a heart. You can just pull off one of those little heart-shaped leaves and it's a really sweet thing like a cutout. Now I'm going to draw a few friends for the dragon. Is this a dragon baby or another creature? I'm not sure. This is kind of like a butterfly, I guess. Uh, and I decided my dragon needs a tail, so I'm looking at a fern, and I'm kind of deciding where to put it. I'm just going to glue down the tail. And then I'll make one more little friend for my dragon. And you can make your nature collage however you want. It does not have to be a dragon. It can be any kind of characters. You could glue down all of your nature pieces and then just draw on it later and see what happens. You could try out different things. That's what I did here. I just glued down a few leaves and drew some characters over it. My son loves the Wings of Fire series, and this is a leaf wing dragon that he made. And that's it. I hope you had fun making nature collages. I can't wait to see yours. If you can share on social media, I would love to see it at Allison Draws on Instagram and Twitter. Bye!